Hello there, my name is Faith, and today I am going to be making this little octopus. Now this is a 3D printed octopus that can move all of its tentacles, which is really cool. And I painted it to look like a night sky and then a moon. So hopefully that looks kind of cool. This is a finished product, but you can go see past Faith and watch me making it. So my first step was peeling off all of the extra pieces that the 3D printer left behind. And this octopus is literally so cool. It has like articulated um, tentacles, which is amazing. And it's just, I, it's crazy. <laughs> um, again, if I can find it, I'll link it below, but we'll see if I can find it. If not, look up articulated octopus and I'm sure you can find one. Um, this did take a little bit longer than I thought it was going to. Just all those little pieces and the little crevices that were kind of hard to get out, but I managed. So then I moved on to the painting and I usually just use like a tin tray for that part because they're easy to clean and you can reuse them. And I mixed my own purple because I, I wanted a certain shade and none of the purples were that dark. So it's barely even a purple. It's like basically black. Cause I did, I mixed some black in there with it. Cause I wanted to, I wanted to really look like a night sky, which is why I had some stars in later, but yeah. For now, I didn't really focus on like getting in the tiny little spots that were hard to get to. I just f focused on basically just the top of the tentacles. And then later I went through and got more of the little details. Now I'm just painting the head white because um, it is supposed to look like a moon. So, you know, it's gotta be white. And then of course I added some like splotches on it later, but we'll get to that. Um, so now I'm just going back through and I'm getting all the little spots that are hard to get to. And I'm just trying to fill those in with paint. So. Yeah, the same color I used as before, and just trying, just using a smaller brush. And I couldn't get like all of it because that would have taken so long, but I got as much as I could just in that time. Another, I added uh, another coat of white. And now I'm adding all the little stars. I just took a small brush and just I'm just taking white and putting the stars on there. And then I found a picture of the moon and I started adding the splotches. It took a while to get the right color. Like at first it was too dark. So I went over with a lighter color, but just, just keep working at it and you'll find one. To make it look like a moon more, you need to uh, add like some dark on top of the light. And then after all of that, you add some splotches. And then after that, you add some splotches of white. And that was me making this little octopus. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. If you want to see the 3D print, the, um, the 3D printer printing it, 
then you can just continue watching because I'm about to show that. Um, so yeah, it's just time lapse. So hope you enjoyed and I will see you all next week. Bye!